In this video, I want to briefly discuss the difference between a posterior anterior frontal chest x-ray and an anterior posterior frontal chest x-ray. Usually the PA technique is preferred. Reason for that is that the x-ray source is behind the patient and the belly and chest of the patient is towards the detector plate as opposed to an AP view which is exactly in reverse. Now this technique gives a way more realistic view of the size of the heart and the reason for that is that the heart is an anterior mediastinal structure and so since it's closer to the detector plate in a PA view the shadow of the heart is much less magnified and so you can reliably determine the cardiothoracic ratio using a PA view. On an anteroposterior view, there is much more distance between the heart and the detector plate, and so the heart shadow will be magnified so that a cardiothoracic ratio calculation would be uh, inaccurate. That is not to say that an AP view is compu completely useless. If you have a comparable um, AP view, you can actually detect differences in heart size. Maybe a patient has a significant pericardial effusion, for instance, or cardiac dilatation due to other causes. So it's not to say that an AP view is completely useless with regard to interpreting the size of the heart. It's to say that the PA view is, is way more accurate.